there's some here this morning that you're being held captive by things that took place in your past. You made mistakes, you failed, you messed up. I wonder this morning, how many of you would say, you know, it's something in my life and my past that I don't want anybody to know about. Is there anybody like that this morning? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I said, right, Kyle, I'm not raising my hand, but I'm raising it right here, okay? You know, don't want anybody to know. We all have things that we look back in our past and we're like, man, I messed up. Man, I don't want anybody to know about that. Yikes. There's things in here that your spouse doesn't even know about from your past, and you're like, man, I don't want anybody to know. But this is, and I'll tell you why. Listen, you're at a place where you're like, but God could never do anything with me because of what I was, because of what happened back then. And you're in bondage to it. You say, Kyle, how do you know about that? Because I've been there. Man, it's amazing how the devil can, can take something from our past life and can use it to wrap us up and just hold us captive. You know what's so cool? God has a way of taking things that, that man, we don't want anybody to know about. God has a way of taking those things, loosing us of them, and then putting them as a weapon in our hand to beat the devil with. <laughs> 